Hi. Here we are at day six of Sing a Song a Day Challenge. Um, I don't know how we got here so fast, but here we are. I promised you yesterday that I would sing um, another version of the cuckoo. This one's uh, the one I learned very first when I was two years old and I already was showing signs that I was a singer. Um, my mother gave my father and I this kid's songbook. Um, sorry, it's backwards on camera, I guess. It's called Lullabies and Night Songs. The uh, music is composed by Alec Wilder and the illustrations are by Maurice Sendak. They're magical. Uh, so you can imagine how much, um, as a child, a musical child, I couldn't wait to sit down at the piano with one of my parents and sing through these songs and look at the pictures. And um, so anyway, I've been singing this my whole life. Here we go. Um, the cuckoo is a pretty bird, The another version. Oh, and thank you to all of you who sent me um, other versions of the this this folk song folk songs are amazing um you know they're, they're so important in the culture and there seems to be uh two ways to treat them and and two types of people there's the the purists and the um the who preserve the originals as closely as they can and that's really important and then there's uh there's those people who evolve the music and do different things with it, improvise, and uh, perhaps they, um, you know, over time, maybe some of the words were forgotten or some of the tune was forgotten, so people innovated and added to it. Mm -hmm. So um, that's why there's so many versions of these folk songs out there, uh, because the, they traveled and evolved. Um, folk music is magical that way and fascinating to study. So here we go. Here's the cuckoo. The Thank you.